And here I am in the Titanic Museum at Cultural uh, Ulster Folk and Transport Museum. And right away in the foyer here, we have got a port hole, a hot water bottle, uh, part of the Titanic's hull, part of the engine telegraph, and a soup tureen. And you will not find these down in the docks. <coughs> they are here. You will not find anything like them down in the docks. There's the Titanic plate that was used on the side of her. And there's the port hole. So this place has got the real memorabilia. And yet people don't come here and don't know about it. The Titanic exhibition. And this is the Titanic exhibition doorway. This is what I have come to see here. Third class porthole. In we go. I'm pretty third class. Right. And here they are building the Titanic. And, and this guy is giving a wee talk. And he's actually been put in prison because he left the ship. And he's actually, they say he committed mass order. So there is that rule. We don't leave the ship until the passes. And these are some of the, uh, the, uh, the cutlery and, and uh, silverware and whatnot that they would have used on the Titanic. Life on board for the passengers. Come and see this place for yourself. It is the real McCoy. Titanic connections. These are all the boys, uh, famous boys that were connected uh, to the building of the Titanic. These are movies and, and uh, there's a Kenneth Moore and a Night to Remember. And there's a life uh, jacket that would have been worn. And then of course old Kit and Leonardo. And here's a, a Meccano replica of the Titanic. Uh, different uh, ways of uh, selling the Titanic at that particular time, uh, making money out of a tragedy. Survivor stories. Two women who owned these garments led very different lives, but on the 15th of April 1912, they shared the same terrifying experience. So these are the actual. Uh, this is the actual. Uh, hat and, and uh, clothes that one of the people wore. Lily Duff Gordon and Bertha Mul Mulville Hill. Mulville Hill? I don't know. And there she is, the old Titanic photographs on discovering, uncovering the director's album. Uh, there's the uh, wireless operator receiving uh, or, or sending out the, uh, the call for help, call for help, and the Carpathia was, was uh, the closest ship, she was 60 miles away. And the riveting challenge, all oh, right, okay, and these are the various tools made. This, uh, this week's video is not in any shape or order, folks, because I'm trying to, <laughs> trying to, tools of the trade, I'm trying to pack in as much as possible here, and I'm, I'm, I'm I'm not particularly organised, but this building giants. There's the, the yard workers. And there's a lot of the plans over here. There's the grand staircase. And the various items, paintings. Uh, Typical of the, of the time, this uh, glass, uh, stained glass window. That's the Olympic, which we are not really here to talk about. And there she is herself going down. And this is interesting, folks. This is very interesting. First class saved quite a number. And then, look. There's all the people out on deck. Second class saved. Well, maybe not so many. And third class lost. Look at the pile of third class.
class people that was lost and uh, the numbers of sailors who were actually lost as well. Different posters from the time, different um, uh, kinds of uh, panelling that would have been used. And I'm just running on round. There we go. And this uh, decorated cello, cello backplate paying tribute to the cellists from the Titanic who actually went down with the ship and they played Nearer My God to Thee. There we are. Come along and see the Titanic exhibition for yourselves, folks. Down at Cultural. from here.